Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are checking out this, what am I saying checking out? Today we are going to be continuing on with our aircraft carrier, as you guys can see. It is in the dock and it is uh, just sitting here, which is, is fine, that is okay. However, what I decided to do, or what I want to do today, is actually add some lifeboats. So, how about we go ahead and build some and uh, get on with it. Also, I have just noticed this. This needs to be deleted. And uh, we might actually build one somewhere around here. That'd be cool. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and build a lifeboat. This is going to be a relatively quick video, so sorry about that. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get on with it, shall we? Hey! Okie dokie. So I, I guess there is actually a bunch of crews on a aircraft carrier that would be uh, interesting to get onto a lifeboat. So we're going to make the lifeboat pretty big, to be honest. We're going to make it relatively large. So let's go ahead and do this like so. There we go. Let's continue this down to there. And yeah, we're just going to make it quite a large boat uh, in order for it to work properly. So put that there all the way down to the edge. Excellent. We're then going to go ahead and grab one of these guys and put it right on there, just like so. And honestly, actually, maybe we just delete this piece. Uh, have this go straight along the bottom and attach straight onto that side. And I think that'll be good, actually. So let's do this all the way down to there. There we go. Very nice. On the front, we'll actually just use one of these. There we go. Excellent. And we'll attach one of these directly onto there. So it's going to be quite, quite a long boat, uh, but that's going to be okay. So attach that onto there. Attach these pieces on as well. And... Yeah, I think I'm going to struggle a little bit with this, but I think it'll be fine. So, let's figure this out, shall we? Go ahead and grab one of these. Whack it onto there. Do this. All right, very nice. Uh, we're then obviously going to fill in the bottom end, and that'll be good. And we honestly actually need to make this um, all full of air, which is going to be the most annoying thing in the world. But that's what we have to do in order for it to actually float. So, we're going to do that. We're then going to do this. Uh, that increases the amount of air on the inside, all the way down to the end. And we're going to make sure all of this actually fits. So there we go. Anyway, grab one of these. And go ahead and attach it directly under there. Just like so. Nope. Not like so. Never mind. Uh, just like this. Excellent. And then obviously we want this going backwards. So do that. And then we can attach the rest on. And that'll be okay. But yeah. For now, go ahead and flip this over. Put it right there. Go ahead and put this piece right here. And we then need to attach these guys to the rest of it. So let's go ahead and do this. Wham. There we go. Uh, all the way out to the edge if we can, so just like so. Delete this piece on the edge, and we should be able to send that backwards, just like so. Yes. Alright, that is actually pretty sick, to be honest. Uh, then we're obviously going to do this backwards to there. And that's looking pretty nice, to be fair. As the bottom of a ship, that actually looks pretty good. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and fill this in with this, so that it has the most air possible. And that all the way down to there. Excellent. That actually looks pretty good, to be fair. Alright, so some of you guys might be wondering why I've built it like this, and I've not just left it empty. Uh, the, the reason being is because if I left it empty, uh, it wouldn't actually float, uh, which is super annoying in Stoneworks, so that's why I've done that. But anyway, we're going to have to go up another one, so hopefully we can do that and it'll work. Uh, and then we'll go from there, so bring this out all the way to here, excellent. Uh, do this on this side, clearly. There we go, backwards to there, delete these guys, and we want this piece on the side of this. So that that works as well. There we go. Very nice. Very nice indeedy. Go ahead and put this across to there. Then we need to do this one. Obviously on the end of this. All the way across to the front. And we need to do the same thing on the rear. And then we are good to go. Alright, flip this over. Turn it around. Bring it this way just like so. Attach these guys directly onto there like this. And there we go. That's awesome. Do this one as well. There we go. And yeah, honestly, I think this will do. I think this will be fine. Uh, we're then actually going to go ahead and attach these guys to the edges. Um, I think we'll do it this way around. I think that is actually okay. Uh, and we'll have it like angled over on the end. That might be pretty silly, but we're going to go with it. So there we go. All the way to there. We're going to do these guys all the way to here. And we're going to go ahead and do that. Yes. I think I'm then going to actually attach most of this at the front together. Because I think that'll look pretty good. And then we're going to do this uh, to attach all of that together again. There we go. All the way back to there, and that's fine. Yeah. All right, nice. Uh, I'm then probably going to copy and paste this from the front backwards, but that's okay. So, whack that, that in straight to there. Excellent. I don't know if I like that, to be honest. I don't know if I like that being on the top. So, we are actually going to get rid of all of that, and we'll actually just have it be flat. And I think that's probably the best way to go about this. So, we're going to do this all the way to the front. 
There we go, just like so. Uh, we're then going to do these pieces on this little bit, and we'll attach that together. And, yeah, I think this is the best way to do this. So, we'll attach all of these together as well, obviously, like so. We're then going to attach these guys together right here, like so. Attach that directly under there. And, I would say that's okay, to be honest. Uh, what we'll do then is fill in these guys. We'll also fill in this guy and this guy, there we go. Uh, we'll fill that in completely, and I think that looks good. Fill in that completely. Then we need the benches all the way along the outside. Or do we do it across? I think we probably do it across, to be honest. So let's do that. So we'll do this. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, we can have rows of about four. This is okay. So seats, let's do it. Yes. Padded seat, go ahead and put one and two. Then we're going to go ahead and copy this in as much as we possibly can. And then we'll go from there. So grab this, go ahead and copy it. Move it forwards, just to here. There we go, move it forwards, just to there. We're going to keep this going until we've uh, filled in the entire thing. And that should be pretty sick, to be honest. So there we go, all the way to the front. Including, oh, we can't quite do this bit. There you go. So merge all of this in. Yes, 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 yes. And yes, there we go. And honestly, I think we're just going to do brown around the top. Uh, so brown straight around this bit. There we go. I think this is going to be okay. We're then going to jug the top bit brown. And we're going to do the inside just around the top brown as well. So there we go. Just around there, brown. Excellent. Yes, that's probably okay. Uh, we need to merge that in, because I didn't do that. That's okay. And, yeah, this looks like a, a nice lifeboat size. I think that's okay. So, what we'll do is actually delete this piece right here. Delete this piece right here. Get ourselves a anchor. And we'll attach that directly onto there, just like so. Same with this piece, just like so. And I think that's fine. We'll then get ourselves a seat that can control this. Uh, and we'll actually do it from a seat. I know that's not quite how you do it, but there you go. That's how we're gonna... Oh no, actually it's not. It's not. We're gonna use one of these. It's okay. So delete that actually. We'll have one there and one there. We'll delete this. We'll actually have uh, one here. And then at the very back, we're gonna put that across there. And we're gonna put this seat directly in the back like so. Excellent. That works. Yeah. We're gonna save loads of lives doing this, guys. It's crazy. Uh, delete those. Go ahead and put that in there like so. And again, and again, and again. I think that's okay. Uh, I might actually make all of these uh, a slightly lighter brown as well. So make those brown, make those brown. All of this, all of that. Yeah, there we go. Maybe the interior will actually be this color. Because at the minute, obviously, it's not quite right. Uh, the easiest way to do that would be to do this, and then jug the outside white. Uh, but we're not going to do it white. We're going to do it gray. Yeah, I think that makes, that makes a lot of sense. I think that works. Yeah, so paint all of this in so that it all works. All the way around the front, paint this and this, and yes. All right, I actually really like the way this looks. Uh, right, now we're going to have to come up with um, a way of propelling this forwards. I'm going to delete this, this, and this. There we go. We're going to get ourselves a propeller. I know this isn't quite what you guys were imagining, um, but there you go. So we're going to hide it somewhat in the boat. That makes sense. We're then going to grab the brown. Go ahead and build this in, one, two. And paint it from the outside this color. There we go. Nice. So, realistically, we actually need a rudder on this as well. Um, that's quite annoying, but we can get away with doing this. All right, control surface. Yeah, we can totally get away with using these, uh, and I think that'll be fine. So, um, put one here, and put one here, and they should do the same thing. So, one there, and one there. Excellent. Um, and that'll be fine, yeah. That'll be completely fine. So, we need a crank. Do, 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 in order to actually power this. Yeah, we do. Okay, that's going to go, like, directly in the middle somewhere around here. Probably, like, there, to be honest. There you go. And we need to be able to put it into this. So, if we can go straight up from here with a pipe. Here we go. Da-da-da-da-da. There we go. Excellent. Straight up into there. It's very nice. Delete this straight up into there. And that should be great, to be honest. Gearboxes. That is what we need. Gear. Here we go. So, a gearbox straight into the engine, which is not there. There we go. Excellent. Uh, we'll make these three to one. Because I believe they should be. Three to one and three to one. Excellent. And now we should be able to actually power this thing backwards. Which is good. Uh, in order to turn as well, I guess we need that figured out too. So let me quickly do this. Uh, get ourselves a throttle. I'm actually just going to go ahead and put it there like that. Uh, and this will attach onto there and there. 
and we'll have a minus number on this, and then we should be able to drive this thing around. Um, realistically. I think that'll actually work. Might need a battery, though. Uh, purely for the gearboxes. So, whack this in directly into here, just like this. We'll actually have two. Uh, trying to balance it out a little bit, that's fine. Uh, attach this. Do, 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 directly onto there, 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 and there. As well as this, and this, and this. Alright. We now need to spawn it in. Uh, actually touching the ground, if we can. So, world view. We are actually floating. We're flying, but that's okay. Bring it down. There's the water. Okay. Spawn it in. Let's see what this does. Do, 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 do. There we go. So, it is actually relatively large compared to the aircraft carrier, but I think that's okay. Oh, and there is water in it. That's a bit of an issue. That is a bit of an issue. Anyway, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, we're tipping over. We're actually tipping over straight away. That's so annoying. That's really annoying. That's really annoying. Uh, right, pivots. Pivots. This is how you fix things. Always in Stormworks. If you have a problem, whack a pivot in it, and it will no longer be a problem. The other thing, actually, is if we delete a few of these down the sides, uh, we grab some of these guys, and we whack them straight into there like that and that, uh, it should actually level itself out very nicely. So, there you go. Just a tip for you guys. Um, do that. Anyway, spawn this in. Let's see what it does. Hopefully it's fine. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it looks like it's flooded more. That's interesting. <laughs> That's very interesting. All right, here we go. Does it move? Why is it flooded more? There's no holes in it, is there? We are actually sinking. Like, big time. Why are we sinking? Oh, this is so annoying. I hate when things are this frustrating. It's really, really, really frustrating. Um, but is there a hole somewhere else that I don't quite know about? There may be. I'm not sure, though. Okay, so like I said, it is floating like there is water inside, and it is definitely floating like there is water inside. Uh, and I don't know where the water is coming in from, so this is a massive issue. This is a huge issue. Where would the... Where would it be coming in from? I have no idea. Ah, that's where it's letting water in from. Okay, so where I actually place the pivots is, uh, realistically, where I place the things as well, and that's why it's sinking. Okay, we found the issue. Let's go ahead and paint that back in, paint this back in, spawn it in, and now we should have fun times. Yeah, there we go. Look, it doesn't even sink anymore. Brilliant. So we get in, we go ahead and sit in our little seat, we crank it up, and we should move the, uh, the lifeboat along. Very, very slowly, but honestly, that is, that is okay. Yeah, we don't want it to be a motorboat, because it is not a motorboat. It is a lifeboat, so that's okay. We can also steer it for this thing, and that's good. All right, nice. I'm happy with that. That's fine. Let's go ahead and put it on the side of our ship and see what it looks like. So we're going to go ahead and save this as uh, old lifeboat. There we go. Excellent. Uh, then we're going to go ahead and copy the entire thing, and then once we've copied the entire thing, uh, we can go ahead and place it on the aircraft carrier, I guess? Yeah, sure. So bring that out to there, bring that out to there, bring it all the way down. Excellent. And I think that's all we need, so we're going to go ahead and cut it. Alright, we're going to go ahead and turn off worldview, and we're going to load up the aircraft carrier itself, which is this one. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. There we go. And now we should be able to put it anywhere on this. I'm not sure where, though. But some places need one. So, yeah. That's a thing. Okay, this doesn't actually seem like a bad place for it, to be totally honest with you guys. So, I might actually place this here. Uh, it will have the ability to get out of there as well. Uh, it is seemingly huge, though. It looks ginormous compared to the main ship. But I'm going to go ahead and paste that there anyway. And we have a lifeboat. Now we just need a way to actually lower it down. Uh, which will probably be a little crane, and I think that'll be pretty sick. Um, but yeah, before we actually continue with doing that, I think I'm going to let you guys decide whether we keep this or not. So, for now, I'm going to go ahead and put it uh, on the <laughs> on here. Uh, we'll go ahead and spawn it in, see what it looks like in terms of its size, and uh, we'll go from there. But um, let me know if you guys like this. I think it looks okay. It might be a bit too big, though. Alright, so now it's time to see if, in terms of its size, it is actually too big for the aircraft carrier. I do think that that is actually pretty large, to be totally honest with you guys. But, uh, if we do have one or two of these, or maybe even three of these, dangling over the side. So, like, one back here, probably around this area. Uh, one in the same place on the other side, dangling just over the edge, like right here. 
and then obviously one down here. I think that's probably enough for everybody on board. Maybe. Um, I guess this would actually have a crew of, like, a lot. But, um, yeah. I don't know. This is... I think it looks nice. I just don't think it's going to work out quite, quite as well as I wanted it to. Because I think it's a little bit big. But... If you guys want me to keep this one, let me know in the comments down below. If you guys want me to make a smaller one, let me know in the comments down below, and we'll go from there. But honestly, I said it was going to be a quick video. It is going to be a quick video. I'm going to end this here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.